I think Inspiration Transfer Institute has several reasons. Mm, supposedly my predecessor, okay, I don't know whether I'm his reincarnation, but anyway, Chancy Chokodoro has built one very famous and renowned university in Tibet, which has produced great many uh, scholars for almost all the Tibetan schools of Buddhism. There has been a big transition period in the Tibetan Buddhism after the Chinese sort of takeover of Tibet. Buddhist education is going down. A lot of young monks are emerging. So I can see there's a lot of reasons why it is necessary to have a school where higher Buddhist or the more advanced Buddhist studies can be taught and practiced. And with all these reasons, first thing what I did was I searched for the teachers to teach. I sent letters, many letters to many different existing living teachers from the past Tongsa University in Tibet. One evening. And an old man came and did a prostration and came towards me and he said, I'm Kunga Wangcho. And uh, I was thrilled, of course, because Kunga Wangcho, I have heard even before that he's one of the few living scholars in Tibet. <laughs> Immediately, after a few days of rest, I mean, he walked all the way from Tibet. He crossed the snow mountains and all the difficulties he went through. Anyway, after a few days, he began to teach to his few students that we have. <laughs> Arrival of Kemba Kunga Wang should become a big news. So many people were aware of it. And I began to have a lot of students coming from different places, even some great uh, high-ranking Rinpoches wanted to study there. So from then on until today, numbers of the students is growing. And but Kunga Wangju has been teaching continuously without stopping. He thinks he's old and before he dies, he should finish teaching everything that he knows. Oh, 
Ginger Gogan, Kana, Chur, Jabogan, do one of the Church Jabogan, I can't say now. Ginger and Egypt, Chief. With all his determination and hard work, now institute has already produced a lot of good students, and already we are sending some students as a teacher to different monasteries in different parts of India, including also Tibet. Actually, right now we have like 93 monasteries monks, different 93 different monasteries. They sent their elite monks to study, so that they can go back and they can teach. Oh, 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 oh,